Hello everyone, welcome back to Positron Plays Hollow Knight. <laughs> a little pause for a second, make sure my recording started there. Uh, so I'm actually outside the room with the little slug people, caterpillar people. Because I remembered I forgot to uh, actually go back and see them. Hey, oh, you give me a lot of money. Oh, a lot more money, okay. Oh my goodness, he's just raining money on top of me. Well, that makes me feel a little silly because I actually did a lot of farming off camera. Um, so that's good. So this must be like another way. Yeah, so every time we get one, he's going to give us more and more and more money. Um, so I actually went and farmed about 300 coins or 300 geos off camera. Uh, primarily because I want to get the, the magnet ability. The one that lets you, um, you know, kind of like sucks in the coins. Uh, essentially, what I think I'll do is anything that's not progression oriented, I'll probably farm off camera. Just like utility stuff, and that way I can get all those upgrades without spending a ton of time just wandering around on camera. I also realized um, when you rest at the bench, I'd actually respawn that first mini boss we fought, and he drops 45 coins, so he's actually a really easy way to farm money early on. Um, so let's see, what do I need here? I need to go to the shop. I'll probably buy the magnet and then um, another pin set of pins would be my guess. Okay, so yes, the gathering swarm will definitely take that. Um, and then this egg, I don't, I almost feel like I should buy that early, but I don't, I don't know what it is. I'm also, I need to figure that out because I'm also curious if it's just like a um, attracts enemies or something. I definitely wouldn't want that. Okay, so we'll get the um. The vendor pin. And that one's a little weird to me, um, but it makes me wonder if there's going to be, like, if it'll show NPCs down below as well. And I should equip that. Here we go. Oh, well, resting in a bench, right. Now, I'm assuming I have two notches. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, okay. So it looks like we have three total. Good. So that will actually, um... Swarm will follow the Baron, yeah. So that way we won't have to worry about uh, picking up coins on our own. But uh, now we can go back down and head to... I think it's like the first boss area. Oh yeah, look at that! Oh, that's adorable! It takes a second for them to, to get to it, but I wonder if they have like unlimited range, but look, the little little flies pop out, little glow bugs pop out and gather them up for you. It's really nice. Definitely saved me a lot of time just to focus on killing stuff and exploring and not worrying about what I'm picking up, and that way we're not losing any uh, any coins along the way, so I make sure I get as many upgrades as possible. Does that have a range? I don't think so. I think it's unlimited range. That's nice. Yeah, I could pretty much... Might have to wait and make sure I'm on screen still, but I could probably pretty much ignore... Um, ignore picking those up in its entirety. In fact, uh, while we're here, I'll show off that this guy is in fact still here every time you rest. Uh, and it's the same fight. He's just like a repeatable fight. Oops. Kinda lost my pattern there for a second. You can probably tell I've done this a few times at this point. A few more hits here. Oh jeez, he actually hit me. It's the first time he's hit me in like, I don't know, four or five times of this. Will they pick up the big ones too? They will, yeah. So you can see there, he gives 45 coins every time. So that's, if you want to pick up some of the early upgrades, just, uh, just go back and forth to town and uh, fight him a number of times and that'll get you some upgrades really fast. That being said, um, I also don't know what like the natural pr progression path of upgrades is. I mean, for all I know, we might actually end up getting all of the upgrades and have money to spare. Um, I have actually no idea, so it's quite possible that the farming is entirely excessive at this point, but I just want to get a lot of the utility stuff like the, uh, well, I'm actually getting hit a lot here. I want to get the utility stuff like the map 
uh, pins and, and things like that early on, just so experience is a little more fluid for everyone else watching. And for my own sanity. Alright, so we haven't been through here. This looks like it's heading towards a, like a boss or something, judging by the map. Oh, there's another one of these guys. Okay. So these are actually like normal enemies. That's interesting. Now this guy, I wonder if I could uh, jump on his head from up above. What's also interesting is I can't remember where that big spike pit is now, uh, but I definitely could bounce across there. I tried down some other ground spikes. It did work, but I can't remember where that big spike pit is. There we go. In fact, was there, is there anything up above here, I wonder? Secret room or anything? No. I can hear their footsteps from quite far away. Yeah, this is definitely heading towards uh, some sort of dangerous place. Oh, I don't know what it is, but here we go. The treasure chest back there. Your footsteps. Ooh. Oh! Hi. It's just you guys. Okay. Well, that's not scary at all. Oh, goodness. Okay. Hello. False knight. Alright. I'm assuming he's gonna stun me if I'm on the ground when he lands. Oh, he does a shockwave. Alright. Oh. Do I have time to heal? Yes. Barely. Oh, nope. Maybe not. Okay, do when he's jumping. Oh, that's... I might have to go under him during that attack. Okay. Ooh! Alright, I broke his armor or something there. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Oh god, now he's really mad. Alright, see if I can heal up here. So we, we exposed him. He's is not the brave knight that he appears to be. He is just a sack of flab in a big bulky suit. I do, however, not have enough uh, focus here. Oh, there we go. Might get some back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can hide in the corner and heal a bit. Good, we got full health back. I feel like he's gonna end up breaking this floor, also. Ooh, yikes. Okay, don't wanna stand there. This guy's got a lot of health, though. I'll give him that. Ooh. Is this gonna be it? Nope. Oh, man. I think he's getting faster. He seems really mad. Oh, jeez. <laughs> sound. Oh, my God. Oh, he was just a big old slug in a... Yep. City crest. Oh, he still hit his... Oh, uh, armor there. Is that City Crest? Is that in my inventory? Yeah. Is it inside on the back that would fit into a slot? Oh, where? That might be the, um... Uh, whatchamacallit. Whoa, that's a lot of money. Um, there's like that slot by the tram. Also... Is there actually something up there? Certainly it looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah, that's very suspicious right there. Big game suspicious. Well, here's a switch. That opens a gate. 
But what else is up here? I don't know, it's spooky looking. Yeah, this place does not seem very friendly. We can go in here. Oh jeez, I don't know if I want to do that. There's a bench here. And some sort of witch. Oh, the shaman. Snail shaman. Wicked looking weapon. I don't know. Do you have help to offer? Nasty little spell. Ooh, what is this? Whoa. Oh dear. Vengeful spirit. Huh. Tap B to unleash the spirit. Oh, where the heck am I? Where did you take me, Snail Shaman? Yeah, where are we? We're now friends. Hard Great Beast. Venture deeper, slay it. Hmm. Okay. Small favor, huh? Oh, it's a curious thing, but this door will not open until you've slain that creature lying in the heart of the temple. Snail Shaman. Ah. You are not trustworthy at all. Interesting I can break that. Whoa! Okay. Now, do I still have... I do. So I can actually have both spells equipped at once, it seems. Interesting. Oh, that does a lot of damage, too. Holy cow, he uses a lot of uh, spirit, though. So where are we, exactly? We're still in this same area. That's awesome. I, that's super powerful. And it doesn't seem like she was talking about the false knight, so... What exactly was she referring to, I wonder? Ooh, don't want to hit the spikes here. You know what? Let's just do that. Boy, I'm gonna need, uh, like a spirit capacity increase or something. Oh, god. Oh, oh, jeez. I don't watch that. These platforms don't seem very sturdy either. Man, those guys are, um, very quick. Especially with the, just like the the swing timer and like how much they get knocked back and stuff, it's a little tricky. There we go. So that's a way out. It looks like, but what's it's down? Oh, oh, that's how you kill these. Okay. Though I do wonder now what was up above that I have apparently now foregone. So that's how you get these guys. Nice. Oh, there's something here. Soul catcher. Oh, it's a badge. Or uh, a charm. Draw more soul. Increase the amount of soul gain when striking an enemy with a nail. Okay. Um I call them call them badges. I, Got Paper Mario on the brain here. Uh, yeah, we'll we'll listen. Yeah, I have. Build it with some rage. Yeah, I guess I owe you some gratitude, but yeah, imagine that. Hmm. 
Yeah, I don't trust you, snail lady. I'm actually gonna go run back up and see what was in that other area. Just in case there was some item hidden there. I have a lot of money again, too, so I, maybe we do get money pretty quickly. I still don't have any sort of uh, double jump or anything, though. We definitely need that to get some places. Yeah, what's in here? Oh, one of these statues. I think that's useful. That is really nice. Of course, you don't get uh, soul from them when you hit them like that. You only get that from hitting them with the, the nail, as it were. Is that an exit? No. Oh, there's money here. And, uh... Oh, that's one of the cocoons, right? That must be... Yeah, that must be one of the cocoons. That's strange, though. As far as I know, these those are just a one-time thing, right? Yeah. I wonder if you're not supposed to actually use those. Like, if there's something if you don't use them. I don't know, that's strange though. It's such a very temporary thing. Oh, many mysteries. Right, let's equip that other badge. Oh, and try <laughs> if you rest, it gets rid of them. Well, that's a bu oh. Oh, this takes two. Oh, yuck. Um, no, I guess we're just not going to use that right now. I definitely need... I mean, we know me. I, I definitely need the uh, the mapping here. Um, hmm. We can see where this connects to now. Oh, what is this? Sorry I missed you. Fearing lost when I pop at a store, purchase a map of this area. Curious. Now, is that because I didn't come back and visit him? Hmm. Well, we can, uh, head up. And, uh... Maybe that'd be a good place to... To pause for now. Head up and... See if he's got a new map for me, and... Um... What other goodies we can buy? Probably buy one more item, be my guess. Now, I know one of them was really expensive. It was like 900 or something. So I am grabbing a couple extra coins here. Plus, um, I should be getting all of them, even though they're falling. I think my little fly friend should be grabbing those. They called them glow bugs before. I meant to say firefly. Glow bug is like <laughs> the, the child word. <laughs> it was just escaping me at the time. Oops. All right. Talk to the Elder, too. Okay, you're talking about the Stag Station, yeah. What about the False Knight, though? Do you have any information on him? Hmm. Leafy Caverns. Seems like that may be where we're supposed to go next. Let's check out the map store quick here and see what, uh... Yeah, it doesn't have anything for sale, so... Right, what do you have here? 
Vessel Fragment. I'm assuming that's like, increases your soul capacity. Uh, that key is probably for the place on the, the right hand side. Yeah, the lantern. I guess I'll get this egg. It's a curious item. And we'll take the mask shard, I suppose. So that's probably like heart containers, would be my guess. So those go up in price, okay. And then uh, I'll buy the last pin, and then we'll save money. I don't want to really want um, that other badge right now. I just don't have the capacity. Whoops. I don't have the capacity for it. <sighs> there we go. Bought all your stuff. Now what? <sighs> Cleaned us out of anything worth selling. Yeah, what is he gonna spend all that geo on? Anyway, that'll do it for now. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did click like, helps a bunch. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you soon.